As usual, when I record something, I have I find a lot of mistakes that I've made and and so forth. Please excuse me, but I'm almost 80 years old, and uh, so again, the group that this was designed for were a, a bunch of seniors. Uh, my own background a little bit. I started teaching in 1964, and I retired in 2004. And during that time, I did pick up some background in computers. In fact, I do have a, a master's in applied mathematics, and, and I have worked at a number of companies, kind of in an engineering department. So I, and I still do a lot of stuff with computers. I like to I fix them and try to help people understand how to use them. I remember my first experience of, with computers in 1981. I was sitting at a computer and I was trying to understand a program called VisiCalc. And that was the predecessor of many spreadsheets, ultimately Excel. And in using this program, the Apple II that I was using did not have up and down cursor movement. You had to hit the space bar to change from left, right to up, down. And the thing that I think got microcomputers really to be popular was the whole idea of a spreadsheet. So that happens to be one of my favorite things. And uh, anyway, please send me any questions you have or if you'd like some more information or other videos, I'd be happy to see if I can come up with something. Thank you. Yeah, my name is Jerry Sabo, and I thought I should explain all my videos, or at least some of them to you. Some of them I took just from travel, but the, the videos I'm referring to were made for a group in Northern California called Sons in Retirement. And that group started in 1978, I believe. Uh, excuse me, 1958. Our local branch, Branch 59, I think probably started in about 1975. And one of our subgroups was a group called Cyber Geezers that I think was started by a friend, Fred Gotthard. And when I came to SIRS in 19, 2004, I guess, Fred was the, the leader of the group of Cyber Geezers. And as Fred got older, he handed this job over to me. Now, during COVID, we stopped going to the place where we met and talked about technology and we started doing Zoom meetings. And so I started putting together a bunch of, of, of little videos for my group of cyber geezers. And I want to explain especially the one about photo organization. So in the beginning I had, I was basically using my iPhone and recording my some things and they're pretty sloppy. So if you uh, happen to be interested in for photography, you please ex realize that my first push portion of COVID, what I started doing was I started trying to organize my photographs and I had many, many, many thousands of photographs and also a lot of negatives that I thought I should scan and put in digital format. So this is where this all began, this sequence of videos. I first of all began by explaining how to scan the videos and then eventually how to organize. And then it, it has evolved into a lot of subtopics involving computers. So please understand that there is some semblance of organization, but I'll have to figure out what that semblance is. Anyway, thank you.